Welcome back to Pathologic 2. Last night we visited Death's house once again in the sprawl, the crude sprawl. Which got Notkin infected, I'm pretty certain. But it did protect the crude sprawl. Now it's 12.21pm on day 4. We only have two things at the moment. Go to the hospital to start our first day's worth of rounds. And Sabarov seized father's murderer. Spoiler, they're not my father's murderer. I don't know if there's any point in going there. If I'm in the area, I guess. But I'm not going to make it a priority because it leads nowhere and they are not my father's murderer. So for now, let's go do our rounds. And I want to try to protect people as much as possible. I want to give protection to bad grief. Last time I visited there, they weren't actually home, so I couldn't do that. And last time I went to Notkin's place, I couldn't actually go inside for some reason. So I'm going to try again and see if I can give them my one remaining schmouter, because at the moment they're the only infected person on my list. Oh, hey, Murky. The plague bringer is here, walking around. Why should I love you? I don't need to love you at all. I can stop loving you whenever I want. I see. What's wrong? Tell me. Let's go catch some roosters. I'll show you something. Roosters? It's a kind of grass with a little comb on top. I know every kind of grass. They show themselves to me. I know them even better than those dancing, prancing girls. Let's go? We're not going now. Let's go at night. Come to my train car and use our secret knock. I remember getting this quest, and even I, I even wrote it down in my notes, actually, that specific series of knocks just in case I needed them. Where are they? Here it is. I don't remember what happened, though. I never... I never got a chance to use them, or maybe I didn't have to knock when I went there. I don't remember. Oh, I think I said this. Come live with me. I should still do that, right? I shouldn't leave them in the train car. Uh, let's meet him there tonight. I'm, I'm sure we can invite him later. I better be able to. I'm going to be real sad if I can't. Deal. I'll try to remember. An orphan girl named Murky knocked on my door. I feel like it's not the last I'm seeing of her. I think she doesn't like me. What do I do with her? Kid, what are you doing outside here? Just with the plague floating around. Thanks for coming by. Oh, 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 oh! I think this is when we're gonna hear what happened to Patches. Please tell me Patches survived. I gave them a schmouter. Please? I'm just here to check in on Patches. Shit! He still dies! So it's not from the infection, at least not directly, they're just, they ended up too weak and they just couldn't take the schmouter or any treatment or anything. Fuck. I'm sorry, kids. I fear Notkin could have got the infection, but we hope it's just canine distemper. <laughs> Shoot hair. No, no. Here, this is for you. Made by our scouts. What is it? A map of the infection. Our scouts sneak everywhere. Will it be useful? I can tell them to be more careful going into an infected... Infected districts when they're scouting. I don't know if it does anything, but let's do it. Um, hand it over and never do that again. They're gonna still do it. <laughs> Doesn't matter. So, who is in trouble now? I think I maybe found all the places of infection just walking through the night. Yeah, Yulia's good. The Olgimskis are good. And I'm about to do Knockin and Bad Grief, and then... Uh, I've already done Sticky, already done Andre Stamaton. Yeah. Just these two to do, and we're good. Hey, buddy. I'm 
not even going to talk with you. Just... Here. You're good. Well, my right paws. Well, my bloodhounds. It hurts, but it's different now. What did you give me? That insane mixture of yours made from various pills? A schmouter? Are you nuts? Why did you waste it on me? Who else? They can be kind of lethal, by the way. If you're weak. Like Patches was. But you're alive. They have interesting things that they're wearing around their neck. I'm not exactly sure what they are, and I can't get any closer. I think at least one of them's a whistle. Probably a dog whistle, I would assume, because... You know, dogs. Let's see if we can do any trading. Marble. Charm is worth six. That might be worth trading rather than selling, possibly. Well, the fingernails are always super cheap. More antibiotics would be good. Canned food would be good. If I just give you all my chalk for the antibiotics, I think that's worth it. Yeah. Hey, fucker. You think you've saved him? You cheat. Only got him a brief break from death. Did not keep me at bay forever. And so I will return to him again and again. And you shall not have such wild potions with you. Little remains. I'm not in the habit of speaking to hallucinations. I seek them all, all those on your list. Joyfully. I might take them one by one. I might take them all at once. Yeah, one by one would be better. You have me there, warrior. I relish that you're fearless enough to offer straight answers. One by one it is, then. I'll find a way to beat you. Just you wait. I'm not afraid. You are a fool, Barah. You know nothing. You're an unbearable bore, no fun at all. Likewise, you're not here to be played with. You deserve to be hunted down and destroyed. Did I ever try this? Damn. Alright, bad grief. You better be home, bad boy. Oh, bad boy's a good boy today. Metro Plus, and you'll be fine. Oh. Well, that's interesting. When I gave him the prophylaxis, it made it so I can't talk with him anymore. I guess we were going to speak about the prophylaxis, I suppose. You have a lot of money, so let's sell you all of these rings and pocket watches. Still not quite enough. Ooh, so they do buy lockpicks, but they really don't pay very much for them at all. This one's in full condition, and they only pay 94 11,000 for a shotgun. Um, no. <laughs> yeah, let's just go with that. Uh, actually, let's sell the pocket watch because it's large. I have quite a lot of money. What should I buy? Um... To upgrade my inventory again, I need that cloth toolkit. So I should definitely buy that. Plus another toolkit would be good just for upgrading the Alembic and whatnot. Yeah. Ruben is marked here? Why does it look like the mark is just outside the theater, though? But again, this one looks like it's just outside the theater as well. So probably meaningless. I think it's just to separate the two icons so they don't overlap too much. Aspity doesn't know for certain what Uderg means, but perhaps I can extract more out of her. I don't think I really do get more out of her. Another one of those low-priority things, I think. 
Hmm. I was just about to stop at this clothes store to look for that toolkit, and I hear the piano. Remember the one that's associated with Capella? Did I pull it? That one. Well, let me go to the clothes store first. There it is, sewing box. Ooh, they have high quality gloves too. I think clothes are kind of just worth buying. It's better to have them early because then it saves you a lot of your immunity being lost. I think I need red thread as well. I can always use it anyway. And it's cheap, it's so cheap. I guess I could use the thimble too, I suppose. And the sewing box. And the gloves. And I'll sell them this ring. Oh, I also have the charm. 380. I think it's worth selling more than trading. Not a huge amount of money, but a pretty good amount of money. And these cloth gloves, oh man, they're about to break. I might as well just sell them for 50 coin, sure. Nice. Crappy shoes, decent gloves, decent cloak, although I'm going to use that to upgrade my inventory, so I'm going to need another one. The sewing box smells of home. Gravel once knitted a sweater for me. I asked her why it was blue. She told me that blue is the color of morons and never made me another. <laughs> That's a great story. <laughs> Uh, Lara's, or her gravel, is awesome. I think the first one that you discover is Capella. And that's how you kind of get the quest. Because they're like, I heard a piano and, uh, yeah. There's a peculiar smell outside. What is it? Did you see who it was? I didn't see anyone. Mother's favorite melody. <laughs> hmm. Hear it often. Walk down the street and it comes from a window or from a backyard and... Hmm. Someone must have overheard the melody. They're playing a trick on you. The why? Who would do something like this? The changeling? <laughs> Doesn't matter. It's driving me mad. Well... If I hear this melody again, I'll try to figure it out. Heading into the theater. We have a lot of work to do here. I need to help people, I need to speak with Reuben, and I need to extract infected organs to do lots of experiments. Just stay away from me this time of year. Come to think of it, keep your hands off anything here. I've come... I've come to help. There must be something I can do, right? I'm sure there's something you can do. Okay. I'll find a way to help on my own. And you? What are you up to? Me? It's a tough one, I suppose. I'm going to make a cure for the sand pest. A cure? In these conditions? Don't you need... I don't know, special instruments? An army of chemists? The best we have is a kitchen stove. How do you hope to succeed? Hey, Pasteur and Coach worked in barns. Never stopped them. This hunt for blood sounds dangerous, Cub. Won't you just infect yourself? Promise me I'll be as careful as you can. If you need me, please ask. Thank you, Laura. You're the only one who believes in me. Will you drop by today? Sure. In an hour or so. I think it's going to be more than an hour. Sorry, Laura. Is this the day when we do the water thing? I don't know if it's this early, but it might be. You aren't cub anymore, Burach. Time to grow up. You know what? I'm so sick of you saying that. I'm just going to turn into a little baby. I'm going to grow down. Yes. Stah. Take a look at this sigil. It's called Uderg. Ever heard of that? More kin nonsense. They mark bulls with this. What does it matter? I have no interest in their stupid cattle brands. 
so no love for our kind. Why? Your father wasted too much effort on that rabble. Big words. They distracted him from his work, wanted him to live for them, toil for them, tend to them. All they need is an owner, a protector, a caretaker, someone to cling to like fleas draining their blood. They're all about blood. So, I wonder if this is early enough that Reuben has started with their experiments that have pissed off the kin. I think it is. Someone has a temper. Is this personal? Wolves. Wolves, each and every one of them. They surround you, smother you, they wait till you're out of breath, then they press on and on and on. They put him into an early grave, the blasted kin, and I'm soon to follow. What? You? What reason could they possibly have? Well, maybe I gave them a reason. Or maybe it's habit for them by now. Look, take your damn sigil and get lost. You picked a curious time to study folklore. You need work or what? Let me know and I'll make you busy. Folklore, there's an idea. Doesn't Ogimsky's son record step folklore? Yes, they do. Oh, we you keep talking. Cub anymore, Burach. Time to grow up. Nope, I'm growing down, buddy. Where have you been? We're drowning in work. Okay, yep. What do you need me to do? Um, we try different older medicines, study their effects, but the supply is short. Blah blah blah. Reuben basically just bashing me over the head verbally. Okay. You aren't cub anymore, Burach. Time to grow up. Is that the only thing you say, Reuben? Okay, blah blah blah, you need to work. Okay, what can I do right now? Painkillers, can you brew more? Mm-hmm. There really was not a single recovery five years ago. Yep. Huh. Okay, give painkillers to all living patients. Hello. What once was a theater of comedy is now an anatomy theater. It was a theater of tragedy. Each day will bring new jobs. Mm -hmm. Let's see what they left for us to work with. Bandage, a little bit of ba uh, antibiotics, and two morphines. Do I have enough? Morphines. Five, yeah. Plus the one that I brewed, so I do have enough to finish this quest. Wait, your pain isn't high, though. Do you actually... Oh, I should cure some of these people. I mean, not cure them, but uh, treat them at least, so I can get the fund up as much as possible. Yeah. Yeah, that's really important. I want to max that thing out every day that I can. If it's at all possible. So, yeah, what exactly does it say? Need to lower the patient's pain. There are some painkillers in the hospital, but I'll need to obtain the rest myself. Do any of them have high pain? Or do I just give it to them anyway? I think I just give it to them anyway. That did it? Yeah. Okay, so now let's actually treat them. Mm. Let's start with a Medril Plus. Ah, definitive. It is nerves. Here you go, buddy. People like me more, and that pretty massively increases the fund. Nerves or blood, so I think it must be blood. 
Because I used a plus tincture. Yep, that worked. Oh, where am I on the fund? Okay, I probably need to treat two or three more people. Nerves or bone, so probably bone. Pretty high up on the fund. I'm so excited for what I'm going to get from the fund. I think this is like a prepayment. What's a prepayment called? An advance? So I don't think that's going to increase with the work that I've done. Probably won't be until tomorrow until I see the, the huge amount that they're going to give me. I assume a huge amount. Better be a lot. <laughs> All right, where's the other patient? Here you are. Nerves. Good, because I didn't have any bone treatment. Oh man, that makes people like me a lot more. And I've maxed out the fund. Hell yeah. In fact, I probably should have completed that quest first because doing my doctor's round, I think, increases the fund anyway. So maybe I didn't have to treat that many people. I'm not sure. Anyway, it's fine. Yeah, sweet. Oh, I can't wait to see what I get tomorrow. So much more food. I remember one time when I think I maxed out the fund, I think I got like 6,000 coin. I wonder if it's going to be that every day or if it varies based on supply. <laughs> I imagine supplies dwindle more and more towards the end, so I'd expect them to be the most plentiful now. Right. I also wanted to get organs from infected people here, but they're all covered. There's no just dead bodies. I, I can't examine them. Let me check upstairs, but I think I'm going to have to go into an infected district. Could there be ones in the back? No, they're all in our blankets. Yeah, I gotta get them in the wild. Okay, that is extremely important. But it might be a good idea to wait on that until I'm closer to my home. But then again, I kind of need to get that stuff brewing, right? Uh, let's go pay a visit to Laura. Also, there's a cash up here that I want to hit up. I don't want to neglect the caches. It's right here. Don't even think about going to the nutshell. Han got down and it has solid walls and he tries to cross them and they won't budge. I saw it too. He's angry like a ferret. Don't go to the nutshell, he tries to cross the walls. So the Han is angry that, unlike the polyhedron, the walls are solid at the nutshell. <laughs> yeah, we've heard that the the, uh, the polyhedron is full of wonders and it has optical illusion effects and stuff. I guess there's a lot of fake walls there. Wait, what did that mark? Oh, just that I can go visit Kosparkine. Right, that's where we found out that they left the polyhedron because they didn't want to risk infecting anyone. Let's leave a match. About to go inside of Laura's place, but first, let's get the cash right next to their house, because I forgot to get it all the other times I was here. Mm, chestnut. Hey? Oh, I thought they were going to tell me something about the game. Like, hey, good job, you're doing great in the game. But no, their Vlad Olgimski concerns the most urgent matter. Okay, I'll come by as soon as I have the time. Oh, their master is the younger Olgimski. That changes everything. Thanks, kid. What do they invite me over there for? I don't remember why they invite me there. 
Let's speak with Laura. They lived happily ever after and horribly ever before. Ah, oh, this is the day the water thing happens. Okay, Laura, I'm going to help you set this place up. Don't you worry. Cub, I'm in trouble. Have you heard about the water? No. We're running out of water. They won't carry in more from the step springs because of the quarantine. And last night, someone sabotaged the water pumps. The remaining barrels are all we have. Do you understand? Idiots. It's not cholera. Things are bad, Cub. God knows when the water barrels will return to the step. Those barrels are all we have and they'll be guarded. Each person is only allowed one bottle. So water pump next to your house. Want me to fix it? Uh, yes, be nice of you, but that's not what I need. I need drinking water, lots of it. They want to provide a place for the healthy people who have lost their homes, a home for the living. My house is on the outskirts, so the plague wouldn't reach us here. Eh, <laughs> it will reach you eventually, but still a good idea. I've always respected you, Gravel, and my respect just grew. Father would approve. I suppose he would, yes. Give me a barrel, have it delivered here. You're a doctor, you have special authority. Okay, in the middle town, it's Wimsky's people who will guard the water. Just tell them to listen. I'm actually pretty hungry. I don't think I left any food here. Nope, just some lockpicks, which I will continue to leave here. Laura might have more food here, though. Oh, hell yeah. Laura, I love you. That is good stuff. And even some raisins for little raisin boy who no one likes. I found another cache marked on my map that I haven't visited yet. I believe it's here? Is that right? Uh, isn't it marked here on this map? It's like just right there, like in the middle. Let's pick up some sort of a reward at the town hall. Dankowski, do I need to speak with you? I don't have a marker to do it, but I can. Your behavior is ridiculous. Stop playing detective and start tending to the sick. How can I tend to the sick? I already grew down after talking with Reuben. Now I'm a baby. I. You want me to be a baby doctor? We need to set up the facilities. An isolation ward. A real hospital. We need control over corpse disposal. Tell me, how is it possible this town has never had a proper hospital? Don't women give birth here? Don't people get sick? I'm serious. Can I help you somehow? No, not now. Though, can you tell me what's going on with your water delivery system? Is it true the water is only for industrial purposes? What do you ask? Uh, no reason. Hopefully those are only silly rumors. They're not. Good luck, Emshin. Oh right, the question. You thought I brought in a baby? You thought I brought in a baby? You thought I brought in a baby? Do you visit infected houses during your work? Yep. Everyone who rescues an infant from an infected house is to bring it here. Whoever rescues a baby from an infected district and brings it to the town hall will be rewarded. Dr. Bura, right? Here's your allowance for today. Uh, yep, the fund. Ooh. 2,000 bucks. I mean, they're not, they're not bucks, they're not dollars. <laughs> 2,000 monies. Can I eat all this toast? Ah, eh, not quite. The other one would be wasted. I'm rapidly running out of inventory space. I'm going to head into this infected district here, looking for any water. I don't know if the water would be in an infected district. I feel like it probably wouldn't, but just in case, I want to go here to do that. I want to see if I can find some infected bodies that I can cut and get at least a couple organs, whatever I have space for. 
end. I believe there's at least one cache in here. According to my map, it's right here. Plus, I feel like every one of these things also has a cache, so I kind of want to check there, too. Mm, I've got some immunity boosters. Well, one immunity booster. But I also have decent clothes, so that should protect me pretty well. Hey, you stump. Who are you? Drop out to warm myself up from the cannery, canning stuff. What are you doing here? No idea. That is very strange, yes. Ooh, could this be one of the waters, actually? Yeah, you look like a water guard. Clean water? do-gooder. Are you Burach? Your father's house is being robbed. Right now. Oh god, that happens today? Shit. The things are just piling on, huh? By whom? How should I know? People are looting. Mm -hmm. I'll be fine. Thanks. I don't know if I'm gonna go there. Maybe... Maybe. An inspection, huh? Tis all silliness, if you ask me. The water's all right. People drank it and no one died. So barrels have guards standing over them now? Master's orders. Very thoughtful of him. And Sabrov issued an order, too. One bottle per person, and not a drop more. Sounds right. Dying of thirst is better than dying of sand pest. Less torturous. Rumor is, step people infected the barrels last night. Don't take offense, sir. Might also have been the plague bear, the bone-legged wench. Remember the hunt for her? Well, where there's smoke, there's fire. Guess there was a good reason behind the hunt, after all. No, there wasn't, you fucking asshole. <laughs> what a lady, always up to all sorts of mischief despite the bone legs. Don't make fun of me, Doctor. If you live to my age, you'll sing a different tune. Who are you protecting the barrels from? I've uh, been told to stand guard here because those are our last sips of clear water. The water pipes were destroyed last night. The fools decided the infection's waterborne from the Gorhon. Okay, now what? All barrels are to be examined. If anything suspicious is found, all barrels from that part of town are to be seized. Can't be too sure. Hmm. Failing suspicious is found. Take a sample. Run to Professor Dankowski to report if anything is off. Right, so I need a good excuse to take one. Which means I think I need to get a sample of muddy water, but this one is good. So I need to find some muddy water and then bring it to Dan Dankowski, I guess? Any source of water inside of an infected district should do. Hey, buddy. Oh, right, they want medicine because they're in an infected district. Oh, ton? That's not going to stack with my milk. I don't think I want that. But then again, I can... I can get that and this for just a couple basic tinctures. I think that's worth it. Wow, I'm not as hungry as I thought I was. I don't think Tawn restores much hunger. I'm gonna just use it now. Yeah, I didn't even do it all the way. Tawn really isn't great. It just really isn't. I'll leave the rotten food. <laughs> okay, so I haven't been to this one, right? Oh no, I actually have been to this one. Okay, but there should be one here too. At least I hope... Oh, fuck you. At least I hope I didn't mark that for no reason. Jerboa! Oh, disappeared. Why did I mark it? Where... where could it be? Why did I... Why did I mark things that just seemed to be bullshit? 
Hey, past Marshall. Why did you do this? Okay, I still need water, muddy water. And I need infected organs, of which I could fit a couple. I could fit blood plus a liver. And I mean, I'll drop some stuff to make room. Oh, sh oh shit, my immunity is out. Whew. How are my clothes doing, by the way? Yeah, not bad. Well, shoes are shit. I think I might have to go inside of a house to find a dead body. Oh, here we go. Muddy water. So I just have to go to Dankovsky even though there's no marking, right? I guess so. Alright, let's go into an infected house. I want to try to get some organs. This is gonna suck, 